Legend of Total War here with part 67 of my Stainless Steel 6.4 uh, Pure Hearted Crusader States Let's Play campaign. Uh, previously, we've uh, just basically just been building shit, but we've made our way over here to Turku, here in Finland, against the Norwegians. Ready to say. I'll put this actually here. Let's say. You will. To take that settlement. Alright, so let's see. Uh, what else does that do? Ah, uh, build shit. Uh, let's see. So, cathedrals. We don't really need that that much. Yeah, build the merchant's court. I mean, it takes a long time to build, but anything we can do to increase the amount of money we make, even if it's only by a small margin, just do it. And with Acre, they need to be focusing on population growth. Okay, Arta here must have a, um, yeah, there it is. Need to get rid of that. It doesn't help the situation. Lowest, lowest our population growth. Don't need it. I mean, it does reduce corruption, but I'm not really too concerned about any individual city's corruption, because we can just, if we can capture a few more Master Thieves Guild, or Master Assassin's Guild, it'll make up for that. Also makes religion less effective or religious growth. Another one that's got. Where is it? There it is. See, I didn't build it. Cause it's got that tag, Eastern European. Now, I don't think building or not building them is particularly chivalrous or pure hearted or not. I mean, essentially, the law must be obeyed, pure hearted or not. And sometimes the death penalty is the uh, the most humane to get rid of a, a criminal, I think. As opposed to letting them rot in a dungeon for 50, 60 years, costing the state money, costing the people money to keep these criminals alive. Might as well just end their pitiful existence. You certainly should not forgive criminals. Well, it depends on the kind of crime. Murder, rapists, thieves. Hang on. <laughs> that stupid settlement name. Smile. Kazan's fucked. Massive plague. Build grade. What am I doing here? Let's build up the military. Gotta make sure we can defend ourselves there. It's an important settlement. Okay, seems to be everything done. Let's move on. Didn't make a great deal of profit, but that's fine. Ah, oh, that's something I forgot to do. Excuse me. Oh, you wanna you wanna resume this shit, do ya? Good. Enemies surround us. We are besieged. See what you fucking got. Let's see if they can hold out for play two turns without begging for peace again. Motherfuckers. We we had Casa right under our control. Luckily, our forces are close by. Cease hostilities with the Kingdom of Norway. This has got nothing to do with you, cunt. I'm going to continue fighting. They started this war. They can bloody well finish it without your interference. Alright, so what about the Byzantines over here? That's not too strong there. If we can... If we can besiege it, maybe we can go... And take it next turn. 
you are still alive. Okay, everyone seems like they can make it. I do want to stop this siege, though. What I might do... Let's grab you. And... Stand over here. And besiege the settlement. Okay, so this guy showed up. Because what I'm thinking of is, is maybe doing a draw out. And if nothing else, just to weaken them. I'm not going to be able to kill them all. Because they are easier to fight on the field. Okay, then I'm going to take this army here. And we're going to attack this portion here. Moving to engage the enemy. Alright, we should be able to do it. And without a general, we should get a uh, general after the fight. Alright, let's have a look here. So... That's the only cavalry we've got. That's okay, we'll just infantry smash them. Right, we might as well just charge straight at them, because they've got artillery. They can outrange us in this one. Make sure you stay close behind, so that our guys don't break. Those mangonels, they can do a lot of damage if we're not careful. Make sure we stay spread out. Okay, these guys, hang on, except for you. Charge in there. So far, not too bad. Hang on, come here, here. Got to get to these mangonels. Where are you? Get over here. Oh yeah, if you think you guys are going to get away, you are mistaken. Don't let them hit anything. And hopefully these guys fight to the death. Oh, there we go. Stop the, uh, the, uh, what's it called? Um, oh, fuck, my brain's all retarded right now. It's hot. Um, the mangonels was shooting. Our men are winning the battle. What the if fuck? If we continue like this, we will Losers. smash the enemy. Pull back. I'm going to charge into the back of them. Like I said, end up dead first. Oh, they're broken. Uh, actually, no, just leave them. If they're broken, no point running them down. Not going to gain anything from it. They might be preparing to withdraw. Charge front on is not the best, but Prussian spearmen over here. Well, you can't really expect a great result uh, without without a general, but uh, only half the enemy force remains. Pardieu. our general lies slain. Uh, it's all right. He's not a real general. Here 
we going over here? Shooting them? My army's tiring. No, no, don't chase after them. Leave them be. Just gonna Our shoot them. Are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. So who else is still here on the field? Ah, oh, it's this Kastrofalai case. That's all there is. Très bien. The enemy flees the battle. Run down those worthless peasants. Not too bad. All of Christendom will be awed Killed more of them victory. than they killed of us. That's the goal. And we just hopefully need to get into that city before they ask for a peace treaty. Let him go. Captain Richard. Okay, now he's standing here, so we can attack him again and also draw out the, uh, the enemy garrison. But I also want to defeat these here. Moving to engage the enemy. Huh. Um, doesn't matter. Actually, yeah, you use a night attack. Let's do it. Because we don't want them to break into that fort and kill a unit that I can't actually recruit. The general's bodyguard with no general attached, meaning they're f have free upkeep. But they don't replenish. Ah, it's a river crossing battle. Um, that's okay. I don't think they've got any, any missile units. No, they don't. Wait, hang on. Match Dacrate and... What was the other one? Yeah. So they're about to send a guy over. Shit, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, get back. If they're coming towards us... Ah, oh man, they caught us. It's okay. They only caught the crossbows, just mercenaries, who cares? They're not as good as the mercenary crossbows in vanilla. I don't know what they're doing. But we're going to be able to surround these guys. And I just hope they fight to the death. That's what I want. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. So don't, don't break. Just die, you fucks. The enemy general has no honor. He uh, flees the field of damn. battle and abandons his men. Oh, well, grab him anyway. We'll get the guys some the chivalry. The enemy is badly blotted. They have lost half their men. Enemy flees the battle. Run down those worthless peasants. All of Christendom will be awed by our. We didn't victory. actually kill that many of them. Most of them were just captured, which isn't really ideal. Yes, yes. God be praised for this victory. An honor. Okay, you've got no more fight left in you. But that's okay. We did what we wanted to do there. We liberated or we'll stopped that from being lost. Now you can clip that. For your honor, mon roi. Breaking up the siege. And the king can have another fight. He's actually getting old. Let's have a look in the family tree. Man, there's a lot of people dead. Where is he in the family tree? And who's the heir? Well, he's just as old. But he's pretty good. We're about to see. He's in a Zack. Well, Zack needs to actually build up a fair bit before doing that, so let's try and get him somewhere else. So if I were to get him to Astrakhan, yeah, that looks good. Let's get him to Astrakhan before he dies. Ready and able. Setting camp here, senor. Or 
was I doing? Fighting the Byzantines, that's right. So you... Leave that turd behind. And I want you to attack him. Hmm, it's pretty evenly matched. Well, not completely, but... The whole point of fighting these guys like this was to draw out... Draw them out. And possibly to kill them. Making the battle, when we get to it, a lot easier. We'll have to rely very heavily on our Arbalist militia if we want to get a lot of kills. Because we don't want to capture them. But the Arbalists have only got so much ammunition. Okay, I need to reorganize this. Okay, take the high ground. And just stay here. Alright. Oh, right, they've got artillery. Okay, fuck it. Cavalry, off you go. That artillery is not going to be. Well, actually, it can be quite useful inside the city. Oh, crap. Better hurry. Those guys are coming over here. Oh, fuck me sideways. Luckily, my general there didn't die. Fucking mangonels. Well, tear them up. Hopefully, they don't break. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Okay, that wasn't the best. We'll just need to make sure he doesn't fight anymore. I mean, if he was to shoot one of them, I guess the general's bodyguard's fine, because at least he'll recover. Yep, tear right through them. They're not getting anywhere. Charging them before they break. Or before they charge into us here. The okay, they broke. The they Run down to okay, the enemy army is almost on us. From this side over here, so we need to turn around. I was enjoying shooting them. Okay, turn around to here. No, to, yeah, no, 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 yeah, well, wherever, just turn around to here. Just hurry up. You guys stay over here. I think the battle's going fairly well so far. Alright, we got a bunch of garbage coming in over here, wouldn't worry about too much. What have we got here? More to toy? Okay. Shred him. But the high ground should be easy for him. They just keep shooting them. Doesn't matter if we're taking lots of casualties. If we can get inside this city easily, that'd be fantastic. Sit, shred them. We'll charge soon. We gotta keep an eye on. Okay, what's this? That taught them a lesson.
Okay, here we go. Charge. Oh, that might have just been a little bit too late. Oh, hang on. They didn't really... Ch oh, no, they did. They charged. Get these guys back. Damn it. Didn't treat my Arbalest militia right. I think I'm a bit smashed up there. Oh, well, it happens. Our men have slain I'm sure that's just general. a captain, though. Now his men will lose heart. Surely not that guy. Although, definitely try and shoot him. Because you guys are the ones to do it. Because you do d extra... No, no armor-piercing damage. Okay, the there's a Nathanator over here. Favor. If we remain true I'm not sure if I should do this, but... Will be ours. You stand back, because if you get killed, that's bad. And all I hope is the guy doesn't bloody rout. Okay, he was aiming for, for me and he completely missed. And we char got charge on him. Good. I'm sure my guys can do alright there. Okay, shoot them more to toy. No, 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 shoot him. He's pulling back. Okay, so we're in a good situation here where our guys are just tearing through them in melee and they're not breaking. That's what we want. He's losing, so you charge into the back here and kill him. Charge right into his arsehole. He'll probably like it. He's Greek. Just don't let him break. Oh, motherfucker, he broke. Let him go then. Maybe he'll... No, he's not going to come back. What I'll do is I'll tell my missile units to shoot him. We want him dead or else... Or else what's the point? Oh, they're fighting over here. Let me get rid of them. And bloody well shoot him. Cowardly foe runs. We must push our advantage. Ah, he doesn't want it. The fucking Athanatoi are really hard to get. Sometimes. Turn around, you're about to get fucked in the ass. Well, it didn't really go according to plan, but we have really thinned them out significantly. Alright, you come over here. I want you to come get rid of his motor toy. Uh, at least kill one of these generals for fuck's sake. Stop shooting, it's just gonna get friendly fire. My guys can handle this. So, so he does actually die. Oh no, wrong person. The enemy general flees like the coward he is. Press onward and break the spirit of his army. We have captured oh, the enemy's general. Captured the bastard. Foe runs. We Waste. Must all of Christendom all right, well, we, by our we killed more than we lost, so that's good, I guess. But it really didn't go well. I mean, if this was a normal campaign, we could just execute them, but can't do that. Co-emperor, huh? We've got to let him go. But if we look to what they've got left, it's bare bones. We're not exactly in the best shape either. Just hopefully they don't ask for a ceasefire. It's the worst when they do that. Okay. Should I send these guys in over here? Uh, I can't. 
Alright, time to go pick up some more soldiers. Some more mercenaries here. I'll grab them. Sure. Plenty of money. Alright, now, no more dilly dallying. Let's take this down. Of course, I have no problem with complete overkill, so I'm just gonna send him over here. Who are we using to attack? You, I guess. Okay, needs eight, uh, seven more soldiers in here, so let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it is complete overkill, but I don't mind. Ha! <laughs> failed the mission with the Pope. Pope can kiss my ass! It's got nothing to do with being chivalrous. Doesn't get me ex excommunicated, at least. And I'll just, I'll just give him some money. And he'll feel much, much better. Those popes and their corrupt asses. <sighs> Look at us, we're coming at them from all angles. I put them all on a graph. Oh, I can't do it yet. Let's go put them all on the aggressive stance. Uh, no, I... Yeah, actually, they do want you guys on ladders. Alright, we'll just see how we go. There's... Because we uh, just absolutely outpower them, there's no reason not to just have an all-out attack, really. Actually, I shouldn't have the Arbalus Militia on there. I'll put other units up. So are they doing their job or are they just going to... Okay, I don't expect them to because they don't have siege equipment. The others do, right? Yeah, so use the ladders that I gave you. These guys over here, they're not going to be able to do shit. I'll have to get them to come around this side. You know, it's actually possible to have larger scale battles in Medieval 2 than it is in Total War Attila. Because in Total War Attila, the max amount of troops you can have is um, 40 units per side. But on Medieval 2, it's possible to have an army in the middle, attacking army, plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 lots of reinforcements. That's 9 times 20. The are now in so place. you can have 180 Walls unit no battles for and force of arms. in the single player. Of course, you're fucking CPU, if it's not fucking NASA grade quality, it's probably going to sh absolutely shit itself. I'm not really too concerned about how many casualties we take. I just want the city. It will not be long before our enemies' defenses fall. Everything's replaceable. 
Stop them from running away. So what's going on over here? Are you guys actually attacking or are you just... Okay, you are. Good. I think I've come with ladders. These ones here didn't come with any siege equipment by the looks of it. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash Get those enemy. ladders up on the walls. You come over here. You'll need to pick up these ladders. Because we need to, you know, attack other sections of wall as well, because this is a fortress. So far, things are going well. Get over there, you gotta kill them. Now this is the kind of battle where capturing them is actually good, because they die either way, as long as we win the battle. Grâce à Dieu, we have captured the enemy's walls. Still just keep smashing him, I don't care. Don't let them get away. This is the fucking annoying thing about infantry. What the hell? You guys were supposed to be down here already. Stop avoiding me. Hurry up and get in. One more bash. The battering ram has done its work. Now it is time for brave hearts and brave deeds. Get in there. I just dropped that. Get in here, keep fighting. You guys would tear them apart. And over here, how are we going? Eh, whatever. Just, just, just rush at them. They don't have enough forces to, to defend us in every area. Okay, I want you to grab... Grab this. Give you an order to take this down. I probably shouldn't have put that thing in the way. Good release of the walls there. These guys took the ladders down. Right, come over here. Our men are winning the battle. Right, there we go. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Come on, pick him back. Pick him up. Can't play at six times speed on this battle. There's too many soldiers on the field. I don't know why these guys can do it, but they can't. Okay, there we go. Got him.
break them so we can capture them. Our men have done well. Good, the they're being captured. Fallen. And you try and get over here as quickly as you can. The others will make their way up here and get up on the ladders. Actually, I don't think pikemen are really the best units to be set, uh, setting up on the ladders, but I hate pikes anyway, so who cares? Who cares if they get killed? So, so far, we've killed a third of them. Massive army coming over here. We should still have a massive force after this to be able to send over to Scandinavia to start conquering that as well. You guys will be coming up from the ladders. So hurry up and get over there. You're gonna fight them all or not? Quit dicking around. Battle's taking forever. This is some pretty good units here, but we should be able to bash through them. They can't protect all of their all their walls. And they don't have enough men. Let's start putting the letters up on the wall. Let's go. These guys have a lot of armor, but what's their attack like? It's garbage. They're never gonna get... Hang on. They don't even have much armor. They're never gonna get through... Um, through this here. I might as well just get them to put the ladders up on the wall and then stand back, because I'll just be throwing them away. If they're not in pike formation, they're really not gonna be of any use. But all these other guys here, they can go up and fight. I don't think they do a great job, but I can still send them up there to fight. And I'll have my allies come through the front here. Come on, put the ladders up. Okay, that's one set of letters. You're up first. Go. For valor and force of arms. You'll be up next. Or maybe you. I don't really care. Just get up there and kill them. Killing a couple of them there. And what happened to the units that were here? They haven't really bothered with them. They're shooting them by the looks of it, but not really killing them very many. 
Our men have breached the walls with their ladders. Okay, stop that. You up you get. The battering ram is in place. It will not be long before our enemy's defenses fall. Sit. Get in there and carve them up. Oh, it's actually us that's getting a bit carved up. I guys are doing terrible. Try the general over here so we can boost their morale. That did not go well for them. Oh well, next wave, up we go. We just need to have lots of troops up here to overwhelm them and then they'll fight a bit better. Yeah, this is why I usually don't try and assault with ladders. That's just a slaughter. I mean, they killed like 10 men, and these are good units of mine. I'm just throwing them away here. My best bet is probably to try and get through the gate. But while we're distracting them here, they're not over there, now guys will be able to push through quite easily. Yeah, they absolutely slaughtered my uh, Edessan guard. No big deal. Let's have a look at the, the stats. See, they've got a really high attack bonus, plus they're good against armor, so they'll basically destroy everything. In melee, that is. Oh yeah, good one. Break, just what I need you to do. Just get up there and fight. Our men have done well. The gates have fallen. Doesn't help that my guys are exhausted, but these guys should be getting tired whilst fighting. over here. Could have used you. You come over here. You're going to fight this calf. Jeez, this guy's getting slaughtered. I, mean, I don't particularly care. But... Still, man, should not friggin' put the ladders up. To attack these guys, even as a distraction, it's just disastrous. Just forget it. Don't, don't, don't waste any more soldiers' lives. I mean, the gate's open now. Let's just fuck all this shit right here. Let's, let's come up this way. Get my troops up here. Thrown away enough, enough men. Yeah, I want you to get in here. Sneak up there on, on there if you can. I mean, if they get killed, who cares? They're just crappy archers. Come on, don't break on me. Oh, they drew their attention. I don't, know, I don't care about them. 
they going? But that's okay, they're just getting captured. So I'll get them back. What are my guys doing? The gate's open, let's attack. Fucking attack, assholes. Let's go. Who am I keeping you around for if you're not going to attack? Very messy battle, but like I said, we've got so many troops, all I do is just spam units and just throw them at the enemy and it's fine. I mean, we could use strategy, but... Ah, whatever. I could always have just done my, my technique where I besiege them from two different angles and make them sally out. That's the easiest way to get them. But this is apparently how you fight with honor, which is to say how you fight like a fucking idiot. So you can't... One of the worst things about th these battles is that there's no point waiting around for them to go from exhausted to fresh because you'll be waiting there for all day. Especially at like 4 frames a second or whatever we're getting at the moment. It's, they're going straight to Shaken. Why is that? Must have some dread on him. Also, this general is shit. Got to admit that. What's this here? Okay, if we can get you in your in your formation, you'll you'll do some damage. He's moving in slow motion at the moment. Everyone's tired. General, stay as close behind them as you can, because if they break, that's not good. You get in there as well. Hurry up. These guys are not fantastic against cavalry, but they're good enough. a little bit. But I don't want to risk his life, so get him out of there. Our men are winning the battle. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. Oh, you stupid shit. Do you want pikes down? Let's go. They're shaking. I hope you get over here. That's it, let's just swarm them. Let's go. The battle is very much in our favor. If we remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. So I bet you if I had pressed order reserve, it would have uh, yielded a defeat. The thing is, we've come with a, a large, really terrible army. Rather than like a professional army. If I had come with a smaller but more professional army, I could vastly have reduced the casualties. But I don't mind, I'm just... These guys were just remnants from so many other fights, we're just throwing away basically. Rather than just disband them and starting fresh. Here we got Pikes finally doing something. Both you need to be in pikes. Fuck, get him out of there. Uh oh. Not good, get him out of there. Even have to go all the way around. Uh oh. Only half the enemy force remains. You shouldn't be tired at all. 
could. Looks like we got him out of that. Fucking idiots. Doesn't matter, they'll recover. It's not like they've got any experience to lose. Our men have slain the enemy general. Now my my pikes and everything like that. Now we're doing doing well. Yeah, don't fight them on the walls. That's disastrous. But now they're regretting declaring war on me. I'm not giving the settlement back. This is a fortress from which I can recruit new armies from. Eventually. Seems like we're just swarming them now, and that's fine. in command of the castle. Curses! Our men no longer command the castle. Okay, just a couple of them left and then we're done. I wonder if we lost more than them. Probably. I still got a sizable force even after you know losing nearly 30% of my army. This is an Alright, good. Let's have a look. Here we go. So if we add all that up, yeah, we lost a lot more than the enemy did. Just my force alone. That nah, doesn't matter. We can regenerate those forces alone in the city, given time, and they now can't. Not to mention a lot of them were just mercenaries and just garbage like that. <laughs> Victoire! What was the enemy's is now you all We didn't even have all of our units here. You will. Gonna merge all units. Senior, order. Senior, you will order. Still got more left over here. Okay, and it's time to, to head over here as well. So the Pope wasn't particularly happy with what we did, but. Whatever, you can suck a dick. I'm gonna just give him a bit of a bribe. And noble ally, what can we do for you today? Give him, say, 4,000 for that. You truly have this was a good day for our I've got only my interests at heart, motherfucker. You're just an inconvenient roadblock that needs to be bribed. Alright. General over here. Put this fort down. As you wish, I was going to put there again. I was going to put... Here. And then we want to move this army... I guess we'll just leave it here for now. Joining forces, More as you wish. We, we erecting defensive fortifications. Okay, with that, I think we'll end the video there. It's actually been quite a long one. But yeah, we got that settlement, so that's good. How many settlements do we have now? 90. We don't even have half the map yet. Ah, we would have finished by now if I could have just done my dishonorable tactics, but that's fine. We're having fun, that's the main thing. Anyway, that's the end of this episode, so like and subscribe, part 68's next. And don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.